New at 530, more backlash against Detroit Public Community Schools District after Cass Tech High School is shut down yet another day due to building problems. Investigator Simon Shaykat shows us what's keeping kids out of class and why the superintendent is away during the crisis. Another day of no class due to a broken air conditioning system here at Cass Tech High School. Now the head of the teachers union says this is symbolic of a larger problem in the district. Should a newer school like this be experiencing these kind of issues or? No. From the students to the parents. It sucks that it's at the, at the end of the season. To the teachers. Over 100 million to build that school. It seems everyone is calling out big time problems inside one of Detroit's top high schools built in 2004 for more than 100 million. Closed now for four straight days. Cast Tech's AC and flooding issues have some steaming mad. We want kids to be in school learning. We want to be teachers. We want to be instructing students. It's also uh, right now it's testing season. And so this is going to put us behind um, with our testing. Also in bad shape, Palmer Park Preparatory Academy battling mold issues and a roof replacement. Their elementary and middle school aged kids are temporarily learning elsewhere. And Superintendent Dr. Nikolai Vitti isn't exactly here to face the music. He's up north at the Mackinac Policy Conference where he's promised to advocate for Detroit's children. We left a message with his spokesperson but got no response. It needs to be um, uh, an open conversation with the public from the superintendent on what goes into the decisions that he makes. And Fortunately, there is some good news. The head of the teachers union says she's been notified by the district that students could return to class here at Cast Tech as early as Monday once repairs are complete. From downtown Detroit, Simon Shaykette, 7 Action News.